Hey guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you how to fix Hisense TV black screen. So if you're interested, let's start tutorial. In this case, if you only are getting a uh, black screen on your TV here on your Hisense, well, the first thing you want to do is you need to do some basic troubleshooting first. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to make sure that you actually see if the plug or the cables they have on your TV are properly plugged in. So first, you want to guarantee that your HDMI is properly plugged in. So if you have an HDMI or a VGA, you want to make sure that they are properly plugged in. Because sometimes if you haven't or you didn't plug this in properly, this could cause the black screen itself and not show anything. Now, same thing with the other device. So maybe a console or if you have a, a PC or any other device out there, what you need to do is you also want to make sure that the HDMI on it is actually also properly connected so make sure that the HMI is really connected in there because again it will cause the problem itself as if it's not properly connected now another thing that you might want to do here is you want to make sure that your TV is connected on a working outlet sometimes if the outlet is not providing enough power on your TV this could cause a lot of problems on your TV including a black screen so if it's just a black screen it might not be getting enough power to show you the actual uh, things that is happening on your TV so in this case you might want to switch over to a different outlet try something else maybe get an extension use a different outlet on another room now another thing that you could do here as well is to do a soft reset now, what do you mean by soft resetting a TV? Well, soft resetting a TV means draining the power from it and waiting for a few minutes. So from it, what we need to do here is you just need to basically turn off your TV, unplug it from the outlet, and just wait for a few minutes or even an hour. Now, once the hour or a few minutes is up, you could go and plug it in and turn it on. Now, this will not clear any settings that you've set up on your TV, but this will soft reset it, and hopefully it will work. Now, if that doesn't work, the next thing that you could do here is do a hard reset. So what you need to do is you need to basically press and hold the power button on your actual TV. So this one is different from a soft reset. So in this case, what you need to do is you need to unplug your TV. And from then on with the TV unplug, press and hold the power button on the TV. So not the remote itself, on the actual TV for around 30 seconds or even a 60 seconds if you can. Then in this case, once the 60 seconds is up, you can go and plug it back in and powering, powering it up again and see if that solves the issue. Now, if none of those actually work, you might need to contact support for this one because sometimes there are going to be some problems, especially on the different plugs here. Now, by the way, you could also try using different other or other plugs in here. Sometimes the ports or the other ports here might be the problem itself. So try using this one or this one. So it depends. So you just switch it around here. So yeah. So if none of those work, you could go ahead and go to their official website here, which is Hisense.com. So at the very bottom, you have contact us. So just click on contact us and from here, just fill out their form here to so choose service and from here, provide your information, your email, your phone number. And from here, you could also choose your question here. So I'll be choosing a television here since that's our problem. So you can go ahead and add your message here. So you're having problems with this one or you can even directly contact them on the store where you bought this one and they will have you or in, I basically interact with you on how you could get this fixed. But in this case, that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to the NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.